When saving and loading parameters into the SmartRock D65 Mark II, the first step is to take an EpiRock approved USB stick and insert it into the USB socket. The next step when saving or loading parameters is to navigate to the system function and from there to data save with the USB stick inserted into the machine. At that point, click the transfer button and the machine will save its parameters and load them to the USB stick. Something to keep in mind is, is that the engine needs to be stopped when doing this and it's advised to have no other parameter files on the stick to prevent confusion. Once that's completed, you can remove the stick from the machine. After you've successfully saved the parameters to the USB stick from the machine, it's important that we take them back to a laptop and that we check them to make sure that they're on the stick and working. You may receive an error that says there's a problem with the USB stick. Don't be concerned by that. To check that the parameters are on the stick, You'll insert it into the computer, navigate to the USB drive, open it, and then locate the file named database.txt. Once you've found that, it's advised that you open it by double-clicking on it, which will open Notepad. At the top, you will see the time that the parameters were created, as well as the serial number of the machine and the software version that they were created on, as well as the date. Once you've ensured that they're on the stick, you're on to your next task.